Hangouts Chat is Google's new tool for collaborative messaging so you can communicate with your teams at Stony Brook University. In a web browser at chat.google.com, create a room for your team. Give it a name and click Create. Then add members. Currently, you can only add members with Stony Brook University Google accounts. Start a new conversation by clicking New Thread, adding a message and sending it. Then, to keep topics separate, start a new thread or reply to an existing one. You can also edit or delete your own messages and add reactions to any messages. Need to schedule a meeting with your team? Use the at meet bot. In your team's room, type at meet, select the meet bot, then type schedule a meeting next week, for example. Follow the prompts to then schedule a meeting. You can also upload files or share from Drive. When you share from Drive, the file will automatically be shared, giving everyone comment access. Once you've added the file, click send. Need to quickly meet with your team? Click to add a meet video conference and then send. Then members can click join video meeting to join the video conference. In a room, all members can see the room's entire conversation history, so everyone's on the same page. Any room member can view members and remove existing members or add new members. Right now, chat can only be used within Stony Brook University accounts. In Hangouts Chat, you can also send direct messages to an individual by typing and selecting that person in the Find People Rooms bots at the top. Or select Group Message, choose the group members, and then send a direct message to a group. Direct messages are private in that once you start the message, no one can be added or removed. Direct messages can have history on when the message history is saved or off when messages are deleted after 24 hours. Switch between rooms and direct messages by selecting from the recent and older options on the left. Use search at the center top to search with keywords and for people, types of content, and messages that at mention you. Select whether to search the current room or all room and direct messages. Click go to thread to view a result in context. You'll know you have a new message through new markers on the room, threads at the bottom, and a number at the top. And if you need a break from Hangouts chat notifications, click the drop down near the top left to snooze notifications or access notification settings for more options. In a room, snooze notifications for an individual thread by clicking the thread's bell icon. For direct messages, click the three dots then turn off notifications. And that's Hangouts Chat.